Okay, here I am. Here I is, Tina. My is an embellishment, and I wanted to do, um, I'm still working on this little journal, and I wanted to make a, in, a folder thing. Um, it's a folder pocket thing, and I saw the idea, I got the idea from Alexandra M., and I'm going to post her video below, and hopefully I can do it justice. <laughs> anyway, I, I did, I have the pages, I actually put some lace on it, I'm not normally a lacy person, but I wanted this to be different, so this is like going to be lacy, it's going to be different, it's going to be a little different, just a little bit. So let's see if I can do this. So the measurements, now this will just depend on the measurement of your journal. Now mine's itty bitty, so my pocket's gonna be itty bitty, but you can change the size depending on the size of the journal. So mine is five by, I chose this for the pocket thing, and you'll see what I'm talking about. So this is five. I think it'd be easier to do it this way, or would it be easier to do it this way? Uh, probably, I'll get more out of it if I do this way. So that's five, and five by six and a half. Six and a half, okay. So, like I said, mine's a little bitty, so that's why it's going to be like that. So, um, where is my little punch board? There it is. Nope, I don't know where it is. Oh, you guys, I just lose. Oh, here it is. I don't need it. I just fold this in half. This is going to be the thing. I want to make it. This is craft. This is heavy craft <clears throat> cardstock. I get it at Joann's. It comes in a bunch of colors. Um, so, so with her, you know, since hers were eight and a half by eleven, her page was eight and a half by eleven. Um, hers is going to be a little different. So, but I just need to remember. I'm gonna get my envelope punch board, and I need to remember. Um, how I did this. I think I'm going to go, how did she do that? I think I'm going to go one and a quarter on either side because it's little. And the same on the other side. One and a quarter. Okay, so one and a quarter, I need to make, I need to write that down so I don't remember it. Okay, so then I have this. I'm gonna get this here. And my ruler, which is buried under here. And I'm gonna cut this middle part off. On both sides. Okay, so now we have this, which is kind of cool. Then oh, I need to get this piece of paper. So I said so this is three and three point two five. I can probably do with my little bitty one. So let me go ahead and cut this three and a quarter. Because what we need to do is add some hinges. So I think I'm going to do maybe three quarters. Maybe three quarters of an inch. I don't know exactly how much she did, but. Okay. Three quarters of an inch. 
And then we're gonna um, need to put those, figure out where the center is. I'm just gonna kind of uh, figure, that looks about right. And I'll go ahead and fold these in the center, score these in the center. So, like that. And then you're going to fold these up. And this. Make a shoe. And then I'm going to take. Um, <clears throat> I'm gonna do is just kind of angle them just a little. And these are the hinges. I'm gonna angle them. I need to go to the store. You know what, you guys? I'm just like, yesterday, I decided my first day of retirement should be spent um, removing all the wallpaper from my bathroom. <laughs> um, yeah. But it needed it, and I and I like the way it looks. But I think I might have breathed in some nastiness or something because I don't feel real good. And I need to get this right up to that edge, right to the edge, so it's right like that, and then the other side. Anyway, use some wet glue. So, I mean, I think the worst part of it all was getting up and down the ladder. There was a lot of nasty stuff behind, behind the wallpaper because, you know, before we had, before we got the ventilate, before we got the ventilation fan, you know, with two boys taking long shit. <coughs> excuse me long showers um you know how it is anyway those of you who have boys know how it is so i'm gonna take them i'm gonna take this and i'll put some of this um score tape it is actually just double-sided sticky tape let me see i don't want this to be right here i'll put it on the outside edge it's close to the outside edge. And then here. Sorry, if my head's in the way. <laughs> what? It's so weird. Uh, the boys are hanging out with their mom. You know, they're, they all went somewhere, I think. Her husband had a job out of town, and she asked if the boys could go because he wanted to go, and they're staying in hotels, women in a pool, and all that stuff. So it's just different for me. So we're not going to do anything with that right now. So the other thing I wanted to do is <clears throat> I wanted to make another thing, and this is going to be the thing that goes on the inside. Go ahead and make that. And three point, well, I said five, right? But I'm going to make it like an eighth, a little less, eighth of an inch, just to give me some wiggle room. And 3.25. But I'm going to keep it this way. Let's see. I wanted to make sure. Nope, I'm going to cut it off a little bit more. To make sure it's going to be a little card that goes in here. Come on now. Yeah. Okay. All right. So we have that. And then we'll take my <clears throat> envelope punch board. And I said one and a quarter. So I'm going to do this here one and a quarter.
and quarter. I don't think I'll need that anymore. And then this time, I'm going to get rid of the outside stuff. Yeah, cool. So now we have a little file folder thingy. This will go. You know what? This is bothering me. I'm going to put a little piece of tape right here because it feels... It just feels like it's interfering right there. And she did not do that, but it feels like it is to me. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I think maybe because mine is so itty bitty. Yeah, that one came out really good. So, so now I have to, um, I'm just gonna, scrape my bathroom ceiling <laughs> but I may not do that today I mean I do have time so time is what I have so anyway this will go here and that'll go like that so that'll be like that cute huh cutie cutie patootie so now what she did is she put pockets on the outside she used acetate now I did not use acetate. What did I do with, oh, right here. I decided I wanted to use vellum. So it looks like I need to make these smaller. Just a smidge. I don't, I do not trust myself. I, I, am, I have made so many mistakes. I do not trust myself not using a cutting thing. So I'm going to do this is an eighth of an inch less. Do you know how many times I have tried, have cut it by myself, I mean with my scissors, and it's come out all wonky. So this would go here. Yeah, it's pretty good. And then this would go here. Like that. Okay. Now on one side, and I printed, um, is this the ones I, oh wait, no, I put them right here, right. The first thing I wanted to do was cover this. So I printed out these, which are two to a page. And I thought this would be like this, but I didn't realize, so. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and cut this out like this. The best way I can. So, cover these up. And what I did was, this is also the sepia and ivory, but what I did was I printed these two to a page because I wanted them to be two to a page I think it's two to a page because they're double double you know what I mean they're double there so I'm gonna get my envelope punch board I thought I was done with it but I'm not and I'm gonna come back and I'm gonna uh, one and a quarter only maybe just a smidge left what one and a quarter, just a smidge. And then, it's a shame I'm gonna, did I mess up? No, that's gonna be good. And then I'm gonna take this. Why is it printing this? I don't wanna print them all. No, we'll see. Did it do it? It did. No, it did. Yes, it did. Okay. I'm going to do some ink. Okay, yeah, the first part, I'm sorry, is to cover this up. 
And I am going to do both sides. I thought this would be really pretty. Hmm. This is, I need to come out a little bit more. Why? Because, I don't know, what is it? I guess. I'm gonna, this was one and a quarter. I th oh, you know what? I did it the wrong way. I, let's do one and an eight. It's fine. Just trying to get things better. Yes. So, where's the other one? Where's the other one? Right here. And I'm going to use this to mark this. Let's see what I did. I just cut off that. Think. He's really the best dog. <laughs> he really, really is the best dog. I'm making a mess, y'all. So weird. Um Last night, you know, I guess when you, you know, when you get a certain age, you have some issues that may happen with your stomach. And, um, well, me, me anyway. And, um, it was so nice not to have to go to work this morning. Oops. Okay, I didn't. I like the way this one came out, so I'm going to use it as a guide. different though it's all different all different so I did three and an eighth instead one and an eighth and that was better so I don't know what's gonna I need to go pick up a few things. But there, I think that's just a just fine and dandy. So I'm gonna go ahead and put these on the outside. And I'm going to use this Fabri-Tac because it will not, Fabri-Tac will not, um, what do you call it, bunch up your paper, um, warp your paper. So, adding some glue. So... I think I'm supposed to meet one of my girlfriends tomorrow after she gets off of work. For, for a little quick, for a quick little meal and a Most of my friends live out of town. I had a really good friend that lived in town and then she went on a cruise and met a nice, really nice guy and move to South Carolina. So she's a, every once in a while. You know, I mean, we talk and stuff and she's not really a, she's not really a phone talker. She's more of a text person. There, I like that a lot. And the other, th what I thought I would do with this one, the middle one, I have these, so they could be like journaling space. 
I really like, I don't know if I want to do, I think. I think that would be really pretty. So I think I'm gonna, I am going to go ahead and do that. I just thought that would be pretty. Oh wait, let's do it. Three. Let's just do it this way. And this is right here. I'm gonna come in a little more. And this is right here. A little more. And then, like this here. Yep. And then what I'm gonna do is come get my envelope punch board again. And go three. And an eight, and three and an eight. And then this time again, we cut off the outside. This will go right here. that's fine and it doesn't I don't actually need to put one on both sides I think I'm just gonna leave it and just put one on one side and then the other side well maybe I'll do both let me just do both whatever y'all Tina get real Tina let's see it's easier for me just to make them Make them work. What did I do with my? There. Anyway, I don't know how long this is going to be, but that's okay because you know I thought this was really. I mean, this would be really. I love the idea of this. So, I do. I do. I love it. So I want to. I'm probably gonna incorporate this into a few of my journals um, going forward so because I think it's a really good idea so I like the idea of it now I think I'm done with the punch board my cat I have one cat that loves the outdoors. I mean, because I decided that, you know, I kind of over having a litter box. And so, and we have a nice fenced in backyard. It's got lots of jungle trees and fun stuff. So I thought the cats would like to go outside. This one didn't come out right. All right, maybe not. What did I do? I have no idea. I kind of, um, let me see. It's so, it's close enough. It's close enough. Let's just say it's close enough. I'm gonna just stick it right there. It's close enough. Um, so anyway, one of them just like, oh, love it out here. Let me out, let me just, let me outside, no matter how, just over and over again, just let me outside. The other one's like, oh no, you are not putting me out there, lady. I am not going out there. I am not, I am not an animal. I am not an animal. I am a baby. I'm not going out there. He won't go. Look at me, I got a cut on my finger. We had a, 
Yeah, he told me in no uncertain terms last night that he was not going out. I tried to wrap him in a blanket. No, that didn't work. That's probably why I have a cut on my finger. He tore me up. He's like, no, no lady. Okay, so this will be, I'll put this aside. This will go inside of that. So now, like now we're back to this. Vellum pocket, can't really see that, so, but it's still pretty. I wonder if I should make it shorter. I think I will. I'll take these and make them about a half an inch shorter because, because, because I want to be able to see a little more of that flower. So right now these are, uh, but it's going to make a difference in how big the pockets are on this side. But, so, I like that better. Okay, I'll do that. Okay, so on one side, um, sorry for that. On one side of this, she had pockets that double-sided that way. So anyway, so what she did, I'm going to go ahead and she had it like this. So the first side she did like this, and then she sewed around it. She sewed on the washi tape, so I'm going to do that real quick, sew the washi tape. So in the meantime, what I'm going to do is go ahead and just just a little bit of glue around the edge of this so that just stick it to here. I don't know. And then I was watching this thing. I have an Epson printer, so I was watching this thing that says if you clean the printheads too much, it'll fill up some sort of ink reservoir thing, and then you'll have to buy a new printer because you can't replace it. So I don't even know. I'll try to set it on a different setting. So to use more ink. I have it on the least. So, so what this does is you sew it into the journal like this, and then, then you close it. So you have this inside pocket that goes in the journal. <coughs> And this will have, let's see, the wet glue. My vellum doesn't like wet glue that much. It's okay. Let me check this. Okay, so I got this off the printer. And these are, I'm going to have to cut them down. I, I stopped it because I was like, I'm done. I'm not wait, I'm waiting. I'm not waiting. I'm done. It's just done. Um, so I wanted to use these. I can probably just use this one. Although this one would be kind of cool. Kind of like the bird. So we have to measure. We have to measure. Where's my ruler? Oh, right here. Tina, it's right here. So we have to measure. So we want this to be about one and three quarters. So do this here. One. 
And that cut that little bird in half, so I'm not going to use him. <laughs> I guess I could do this one on him. And quarters, and I could get the bird. Um, so I'm going to do this one. I want to be. this way so I can go one and three quarters and also need to go this way so how deep do I want my pockets probably about I'm gonna do maybe one and a half I know that sounds weird <clears throat> So I'm going to do here, and I'm going to do one and a half. These are tiny. It would be so, I mean, the one that she did was so much bigger because, you know, it was bigger. So these are going to go like this. Like that. I'm gonna get the envelope punch board and I'm gonna put those in the middle as best I can. I'm gonna use this as a as a thing. Okay, so there's those two. And then, so these will be like this. I'm going to go ahead and just put a tiny little bit of glucose. Dot. Just a little. And then on the other side, we're gonna do the pockets this way. So sideways. So half of this, if we go to half, if I had a, you know, if I had been so dumb and not done the whole sheet, I could have done the whole sheet, but, um, <laughs> so let's say this is four and three quarters. So half of four and three quarters is half of four is two, half of three quarters is a quarter and a half. So two and a quarter and a half. <laughs> Okay, so let's do this. And I said this was one and three quarters. Let's do that. I am losing y'all. I know I am. It's fine. It's not meant to. Two. Let's just say if this was the middle. And then I'll adjust. What did I just do? Oh, right there. So what I did was two and five eighths. I want to do this one.
Let's see one and this is fine. It will be fine. I'm gonna do it this way. So tiny. Y'all, I wouldn't recommend doing tiny. Well, do tiny. Do you. You do you, boo. Okay, and then I'm going to do these. I'm going to put this way. Okay, like this. Okay, so what I'm going to do with these, I'm going to put a little bit of glue on the sides of these too. Come on. Just a little. Because I'm going to take these to my sewing machine and I'm going to sew around them. So. That is so cute. All right, I'm gonna sew around all of these. Okay, full disclosure, I had to rip these off because I wanted this pocket to be full and I wanted, so, because I, you know, I wanted it to go all the way across. So I had to rip these off to add these, to sew these on before I, sewed on the other one so anyway that's what it, this is and you put this sew this in your journal and then this will go in here and then you can fill this in fill this up i think what i might do is where's my rounders i think i'll round these corners it might be easier and i like the look of it anyway so now i have a journal card and it'll go in here and it'll be like that in the journal. So, oh, that almost matches. How cool. Anyway, um, let me know what you guys think in the comments. And um, I'm going to come back and do another video and sew all these pages in after, um, yeah, into the spine that I have. So I will next time. See you later. Bye.